Hey YouTube, Blackwatch Jazz here, and today I'm going to be reviewing the Transformers Kingdom War for Cybertron Voyager Class Cyclonus. For his packaging here, we got a nice picture of Cyclonus here, along with his jet mode hanging out in the background here. We got pictures of Cyclonus in his robot and vehicle mode. We got the glorious kingdom artwork which i've already talked about in my previous review and we got the decepticon insignia here on the top that's basically it for the packaging uh the card that i got for this guy is dinobot he looks pretty cool well, the card looks pretty cool not the figure i don't really like the dinobot figure but anyways for scourge himself Going down to detail here, I'm going to remove the gun. So, he's casted in this really nice uh, light purple plastic. He got some translucent orangish red for his for the cockpit. And got a darker purple on the sides here and on the wings. We got a nice silver over on the nose cone. And, we, and then we just got the tip over there. Something really nice about this guy is he does have all three landing gears that are deployable. And you could just put them back in. And I really like how well they are hidden. Now something else you can do. He has ports on the back. I'm going to use these blast effects as an example. You can plug these in to the back of the Scourge. And he could look like he's just blasting off. If, if you want to know where I got these blast effects, they came with the Transformers The Last Night uh, Leader Class Megatron. And those look really nice plugged into a uh, Scourge. Not Scourge, Cyclonus. Speaking of Scourge, for size comparisons, here is Scourge compared to Cyclonus. He looks really nice compared to Cyclonus. Finally here he is compared with Earthrise Skywarp for the transformation. Uh, I like to start off with the cockpit, kind of like open this up, then over here at the side, open that up, unhook that, now you could properly open this up. This can fold in, close back up. Untab the arms. Alright. Now these open up. Then untab these from that little peg right there. Un uh, disconnect the legs. Fold that out. Flip down the foot. Fold all, fold all that in. Oh wait. Extend the leg to about right there. Close that back up. And same on the other side. Flip out the foot. Collapse that in. Fold down the chest. Then hinge these up like that that just swings around then that just folds back that opens up this goes into here fold that down collapse the chest in collapse the back in hinge these out to where they tab in to the chest Fold the arms down. Fold this panel back. Okay, then this hinges back. There's a little gap right here that I like to fold all this back all the way to there where it's kind of hinged out. Same on the other side. And then rotate at the bicep to where the elbow is facing forward. Flip these up. Swing around the fist, 
and close that back up. Same on the other side. Close that up. Now, I believe I am just about done. Here we have the Voyager class, Kingdom Cyclonus, in his robot mode. And he looks really cool. Perfect, like, he is perfectly clean. The thing looks freaking awesome. Like, it's a really clean robot mode and really clean transformation for his articulation. Wait, I'm gonna start off with the head. His head can go up that far. Can look down to a really good degree. He got a bit of this, and his head can do a full 360. Arm hinges out, bicep swivel, bend at the elbow. Arm can move all the way around. Swivel at, swivel at the wrist. He is a waist swivel. He got he can kick far, uh, kick out this, kick forward this far, kick back that far, and kick out that far. Kind of a double bend at the knee if you use that joint. That's usually used for transformation. And he has an ankle pivot. Now. He has this really nice looking uh, gun that is painted in a really high quality uh, matte finish silver. That just goes into his hand. Now he could hold his gun. For some details, he got some nice translucent orange on the chest. He got the nice purple insignia there. He got, he is entirely casted in this purple plastic. We got a nice metallic purple right here. We got a darker purple on the inside of that. We got a darker purple here and here. And a somewhat different shade of purple on the forearms. I think that's what they call it. But I really don't like how, you know, Hasbro can't really keep, how they can't really color match this. And that's annoying. Now, and there's a silver on the thighs and some on the bicep right there. However, the silver does not continue to go down, which is unfortunate. But it's not really that much of a problem. For size comparisons, he's with Scourge, and for some reason he's a good bit taller than Scourge, and I really don't like that. Finally, here he is with Skywarp. That was my review off of the Transformers War for Cybertron Kingdom Voyager class Cyclonus. If you want to see more reviews, let me know in the comments. Uh, I'm not sure what I'm going to be reviewing next. It can be 86. It can be more Earthrise. I don't know. Well, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye.